is up guys, Poldo here, welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Storm Silver Nuzlocke. Last episode, we explored and got our first gym, or our first Kanto badge here in Pewter City, and we are heading out to Route 3. Uh, I believe we got our first encounter here, did we? I actually don't remember, I need to go check the box. Um, I know we fought some trainers in Route 3, but I don't know... If we caught anything, Diglett, where were you? Vermilion City, um, Spiro, is there anything else caught that's in this box? Oh, Noctowl, wasn't Noctowl Route 3? Yes, okay, Noctowl was a Route 3 encounter. But we are, we are heading, uh, into Route 3 still, and out to, uh, Mount Moon. I believe we stopped around here. Yes. All right. So I don't know. I don't remember Mount Moon in this game like whatsoever. I think we have a rival battle coming up in Mount Moon. Uh, Machoke. Let's go into Ashnard. Scary face, huh? I already. I'm slower than you. It doesn't matter. It don't matter none. Hit Paladon. Uh, let's go back into Novar, who just hit level 66. By the way, we're gonna Ice Beam this fat cow. And Clefable, um, Young Continent. Earthquake it. It lit. You just landed a sing? Really? Really? Well, you don't have. Ha 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 ha. You do not have. What What are you doing? Okay. Oof. Oof. Like, you don't have Magic Guard, so you actually die from the Sandstorm. Get destroyed. And I need to. Heal up Young Continent. Oh. There you go. Fix that glitch there. Uh, you look like a karate guy. So I'm just gonna go ahead. No, let's, let's lead with the, with JJ. For this dude. And he does have the, the karate variety. I'm gonna go for the Shadow Ball because I know how it's speed. I just don't want to go for the two-turn fly. Um, which would probably kill, but that kills as well because we are a special attack. Uh, special attackers, and he's weak to it, so you know, that works. We got another Karate Man here. Hello, Mr. Karate Man with your Primate. Uh, you can catch this fly. He has Punishment Swagger. Who the fuck? Okay, he went for Cross Drop. <gasps> oh. We're, we're confused. I don't want to fuck with this thing. Let's go an Ashnard. Surf him. Uh, oh my god. Like, well, between between the Swagger confusion, Breloom, and uh, the Cross Shop crits, I don't know how much a punishment would have done, but oh my god. I, I did not want to find out. Let's go into Young Continent. Um, I think, like, my, really, my only real play is to Earthquake. I didn't want to go into, um, JJ because I thought maybe he might carry, like, Rock Tomb. Oh, yeah, I can get Sport as a Grass type in this game. What flute is it that I have? I know I have a flute. Yeah, wake up. Did you just land a Dynamic Punch? Are you kidding me? Mind Reader into Dynamic Punch, I'm sure. Whatever, get out. Fuck this guy. This guy's an asshole. Vigoroth. Uh, let's go into Coat Rack. His Vigoroth is a physical attacker. I'm not too worried. He probably has, like, something fighting. He has Reversal, which I don't think that's going to do anything. Yeah, I was like, Reversal, is, isn't that the move that does more the less HP you have? So get out. Korak one shots, lowers the speed, doesn't matter. Korak is level 62. And let's fight this guy. Peace, huh? Uh, when you meet the unknown on a mountain road, all you want is peace, right? Sh sure, that's a Magna Zone. Let's go into Young Continent. Magnet. That's Crunch it, I guess. Mirror shot. Okay. Crunch, Gyro Ball. Crunch, Mirror shot. Crunch, Mirror shot. 
and crunch. Okay, I was like, that good fucking magnetic rise bullshit. My JJ is level 64, and a Steelix is coming in. Uh, let's go into Ashnard and surf it. Get it up out. I think that said it was a crit. I don't know. Either way, he's dead. That's all that matters, really. Um, let's leave with Coat Rack. This guy's Fire Breather. Let's see. Weezing. Oh. Ashnard it is. Double hit. Psychic. Gone. Of course, the Fire Breather leads with a, a non-fire type. Whatever. Macargo. There. Okay. Surf. I just want to heal. That's all I want to do. I want, I want to heal and I get my ass in in Mount Moon ASAP. Uh, there's definitely a hidden item somewhere around here. Hyper Potion. Okay. I believe that's a rare candy in red and blue. Okay. So we're here at the Pokemon Center. We're going to nice, nice and heal up. Let's talk to the people here. Hello. And trainers are visiting the mountain. You never know what wild Pokemon you'll encounter. It's very important to recover your Pokemon in a place like this. Don't forget to make a, rec a record of your progress either. Oh my, I remember there was nothing built here when I climbed the mountain. Things change. It's getting more and more convenient. Okay. So, in the Mount Moon we go. Why does that ro Why is that rock... Oh. I didn't expect it to be immediate. Okay. <sighs> hey there, Poldu. You're here in Kanto too. Some of the trainers here are tough, which makes it easy to train. My, he's train my Pokemon, Poldu. I know that you're strong, but I, I, I can't help but challenge you. Uh, slur. Slur. No. I don't know what levels you're gonna have. I'm actually kind of scared. <laughs> Rival. He's gonna lead off with the Hunch Crow. That's pretty decent. A oh, 57. Okay. Um, he might have superpower. I feel like we'll live it though. It's not stab. Coat Rack, you, be you better land this hit. You better land this hit. Thank you. I believe we still have our choice band on, so you are gone. You are absolutely destroyed. There we go. Get this Hunt Crow out of here. Okay, what else? A Kingdra. Uh, I guess we can go into Novarg. I don't know what else we have for a Kingdra. We don't have any Dragon Titan moves. Um, we have an Ice Type move. But even then, I feel like uh, Tri-Attack is our better bet than Ice Beam, so I'm gonna go for the Tri-Attack. Because Ice Beam is still neutral. So if we go for another neutral move, but we also get Stab and Adaptability off of. I feel like that's that's a much better play. Uh, will the Kingdra die, though? It will not. It's... Slur, what the fuck is your problem? It, is your whole team this time around built around Double Team? Like, that... What? Why? Why? We got, we got Young Continent. You better not double team. You're probably gonna outspeed me, but you better not do Oh, you might have Ice Punch. Uh, yeah, yes. Oh, no. Oh, no. Young Continent's not Stab. It's not Stab. It's not. Oh. Alright, we good. I was gonna be so mad if we got, uh, frozen there. I actually believe we could have gone into Ashnart. Well, no. No, that's electric type. But I believe Electivire is part fighting in this game. He's electric fighting. But that gets the Uncontinent to level 64. And Typhlosion. That is a job for Ashnart. Even though he's probably gonna, you know, probably still has that Thunder Punch. I'm not worried. Not worried whatsoever. You get an Earthquake. Okay. Uh, it still doesn't matter to me. Like, what? what is that really gonna do? Nothing. Catch this Surf. Catch, catch all the water. And, uh, why don't, why don't you... Why don't you get out of here? There you go. Okay, I believe he has one Pokemon left. I think it's Gengar. Yep. Okay, so... Gengar... I think we're going into JJ for this one. Because I don't want to catch a Focus Blast with Novarg. Uh, I feel like we might outspeed him with Novarg, but I, I, like I said, I don't... Oh, I think he has one extra poke. We're going to hit him up with a Shadow Ball. 
Oh, Gengar outspeeds me. Okay, it's not a stab. I know it's a Gengar, but we're also special, especially defensive. We're eight levels high. Oh, yeah, eat that up. Embody this Gengar. It lived? Excuse me? Why did it live? It's a Gengar. It has... It's a Gengar, and we're eight levels higher. It should not have lived that. Get out of here. Okay, Alakazam. Um, my first thought is Coat Rack and Sucker Punch. But I think Ashnard's our better play. Because we're, we're definitely gonna get outsped. Um, but we're special walls. Oh, he might have... Ooh, this might not be... Uh, he probably had... Oh, shot. Okay, oh. 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 Eat that up, Ashnard! Oh my god. What is an Alakazam to you? Nothing. That is what... Ashnard... Just, just... We already know. You're gonna catch this energy ball. What... Again, what does that mean? Get out. Get out of here, Slur. I believe... Unless Drano put another one in. Flump! I guess it can't be helped. Uh, I, I guess... I, or, sorry, I, I don't know what I was saying. Um, my training's still not good enough. Oh, my Pokemon is so weak, it makes me frustrated. But I feel... I, I, I can feel that they're, they're getting better after each battle. Gah! Flump! They're still too weak. I need to give them more training. I know, I should take them to Dragon's Den. See if... Oh yeah, we can go to Dragon's Den and have one more battle with him. I forgot about that. Okay, I wanted to, you know, before we went in there, I wanted to check that rock, because it just seemed kind of out of place. I thought there was going to be an item on it, but there was not. Uh, let's put JJ up front because of speed, if we want to run away. Um, but we do get our first encounter here at Mount Moon, and it's already a different layout. I don't remember this Mount Moon whatsoever. Okay, so our first encounter in Mount Moon is a Golbat. That is dupes, so we will we will run from that. Wait. Cliff Fairy. All right. Um, are you gonna live a heat wave? Mm, if you live a heat wave, I, I feel like you will. Hopefully. <gasps> oh my God! <laughs> I just barely lived that. And Healing Wish. I'm glad Healing Wish can't work uh, if you're the only Pokemon, because that, that would have just killed it. Like, he, he actually just tried to kill himself. But Clefairy was caught. Um, I had a Clefairy... What did I name it? Hmm. So the Fairy Pokemon, it, its adorable behavior and crime make it highly popular. However, this cute Pokemon is rarely found. Um, what to name Clefairy? Give me one second. Okay, so, uh, I had a Clefairy in my avatar mode, uh, LP. I named it Boomju. Uh, I, I, I don't like, I, I don't think I'm gonna go with that. Uh, but actually, last episode, I had a comment. Someone, uh, saying, if I catch a Clefairy, which I actually didn't think I was going to, I name it after some, something like a planet or a moon. I kind of like that idea, and I was, I kind of looked, um, <laughs> and Saturn's moons, I, I have the list of all of Saturn's moons right in front of me, one of them's name is Janus, so the bow-legged bitch Janus, who is also a moon, is now on the PC, where does this take us? Wait, seriously? That's... Mount Moon? Well, what? Okay, there, there's clearly something else. Could have got a Sand Slash. Graveler would have been, uh, dupes. Where does this go? Where the hell? Mount Moon Square. Please don't litter. Put trash where it belongs. Where the hell am I? You must be tired from climbing. How about stocking up on supplies? Poke Doll. I'm gonna buy it. I'm gonna buy, like, two. Actually, no, let me buy five. 
That's four. Okay, we can just straight up buy like lemonades and shit here. Okay, let's buy like 20 lemonades. Repels and heart mail. What is this place? Is this in normal heart gold soul silver? When the sun goes down, Clefairy come out to play. What's up here? What do I feel like? What do I feel like Cresselia or some shit's supposed to be here? A max revive. Okay. This place. This place is really cool. Anything else hidden around here? And what is it? Can I get an encounter here? Like in this water? And what is this? Where does this go? Oh, okay. So Mount Moon. And this place was called what? Also Mount Moon. Oh, so I can't get an encounter here. I have a feeling like Cresselia is supposed to be here. Like this just... It's just, just screaming, like, legendary Pokemon. But, I don't know. Um, neat little shop, though. So, we're out on Route 4. Hello. Ampharos. Uh, Young Continent. Light screen catches Earthquake. Gone. Okay, I believe there are a bunch of hidden items around here. Oh. Ultra Ball, okay. Anything else? These like slow, like, uh, slopes are kind of neat. Oh, it's over there, okay. Well, you, I think you're a bird keeper or an electric type Pokemon. Well, you are definitely a bird keeper with level 18. Maybe Adriano forgot to, oh, no, no, it was a fake out. It was absolutely a fake out. <laughs> like level 18 Pidgeot or Pidgeotto? Level 58 Pidgeot. All right. I was about to say, I wonder if Drano forgot to uh, edit that guy. Big mushroom, but no, it was definitely a fake out. Okay. Let's fight you, Picnicker or Backpacker. Picnicker with a furret. Oh, I love furret. Furret's adorable. But ton pass into rapid dash. And he bounced well. Two can play at that. Oh wait, no. Never mind. I was gonna say two can play at that game, but you outspeed me. Stop that. Stop that. There we go. Get this fur back in here. Just try. I'm almost out of try attacks. I, I have one more try attack after this. All right, JJ hitting level 65 off that fur it. I'm sorry for it. Adorable. Rose Ray. I'll stay here and catch this fly. There we go. Nice and hustle boosted fly. And you gave me like no cash. Okay, let's get this back up. So there's this item. What we got? An HP up. Okay. Okay. So we're here in Cerulean. We can get an encounter on Route 4. I want to go. Uh... Yeah, I'm gonna close this. Oh, Cerulean is all types of... Oh, a little bit different. Okay. Let's go heal up. And I want to check out Janice. Let's see here. How you doing? Magic Guard! <gasps> we got magic... Oh my god. And the... Docile nature, which is a neutral nature. Ooh. Problem is, that's another normal type, not fairy here, but has meteor mash, moonlight, light screen, healing wish. I will. That's not a bad Pokemon. Um, do I want to put it on the team? As it currently stands, no. But I could definitely see Jan as being of use. I think we're this late in the game, we're rocking out with five Pokemon. For battles, I'd much rather use Pokemon I've been raising, even if they're weaker than some newly caught Pokemon. Magnet Train travels over 340 miles per hour. It goes between Kanto and Johto in almost no time at all. It really makes Johto accessible. Okay. 
Uh, I guess before we wrap up this episode, we'll go get ourselves... Oh, I thought that was a whooper for a second. <laughs> we'll go get ourselves a Route 4 encounter. See what we can snatch up. Immediately, we run into... A Perugly. Now, this is dupes, or it's species. Because we had a... Not Delcaddy. Uh, meow, not meow stick. Whatever the fuck evolves into this thing. We had one really, really early on. So I'm gonna say no. Glammeow, that's what it's called. Skuntank. Do we have a Stunky? I don't think we do. So let's uh, heat wave it up. Oh, uh, yeah, I was like, you, you eat that toxic. All right. Uh, go in this Ultra Ball. Hey. 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 Stop this. Go rat, get in here. I was like, why'd that do so much? It was a crit. This goddamn skunk tank. Catch this faint attack. I'm gonna heal up, because I don't need anything dumb happening. Full restore. Skun tank, get in the goddamn ball, okay? Okay, you're a female skun tank. I don't think I've ever had uh, a female skun tank. Uh, but I'm gonna name you... Oh, well, okay, okay. <sighs> this is dumb. This is, you're, I was like, you're just a, you're just a skun tank. What is wrong with you? I'm still afraid I'm gonna die, like crit into toxic damage. Oh my, what, what is wrong with you, skun tank? What is wrong with you? It attacks by spraying a, rep, a repellent, or a, a repugnant, repung, repungent, repugnant, smelly fluid from its tail, but the stench dulls after a few squirts. Uh, Skuntank, I'm gonna name you Kix. I don't think Kix is a girl, but from Animal Crossing, you know the 3DS one? Kix the little skunk that sells you shoes. Cause I can't name it Pepe. Cause Pepe is a dude. So let's go heal up. Let's, let's have a look at Kix. Annoying as fuck to catch, but those are two typings I don't think we have. We don't have poison or dark on our team. So, kicks, a modest nature, that doesn't sound you had memento this whole time. You could have just said fuck you and killed yourself. Are you serious? I don't think I mean modest isn't uh it's kinda terrible. Um, do we want to add you to the team? Poison and dark. Yeah, we don't have either of those. We have some dark moves. We don't have any poison moves. But, like, when you think about it, what is poison good against? Uh, bug. I mean, not bug, sorry. Uh, grass. And that's it. Uh, <laughs> it's like, okay, well, when you think about it that way, we have fire, we have flying, we have ice, move coverage, so, you know, and it's another ground weakness. I think that's Stunky's only weakness, is ground. Um, it would give us a psychic immunity. Hmm, I don't know. I'll leave it up to you guys. Who do you think we should take uh, Skun Tank? We, sh should we should we add kicks to the party, or should we rock out with with uh? Wait, I just thought of something. Kicks. What what nature are you? Naive. I mean, adding kicks. Well, no, no, because that's psychic weakness. I'd rather add kicks than a Beedrill, I guess. Beedrill would be kind of neat, but should we add kicks to the party, or should we should we continue on our search for a fifth 
team member. I will let you guys uh, let me know in the comments below. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. Next episode, we will probably explore Cerulean City. Maybe get a, maybe get a new encounter or two. Um, possibly take on the gym. I don't know if I want to explore uh, Route 25 first or take on the gym. I, part of me wants to say explore Route 25 first and then get, go to the gym. But we'll see. We'll see. Uh, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I will see you all next time.